Hi student, this is third unit algebra. Substitution method. Okay, what is meaning by substitution method? In this method, we substitute the value of one variable by expressing it in terms of the other variable to reduce the given equation of two variables into equation of one variable. Since we are substituting the value of one variable in terms of the other variable, this method is calling substitution method. Exercise 3.11 Solve using the method of substitution. The first question 2x minus 3y is equal to 7 5x plus y is equal to 9 The solution First we write the equation number 1 2x minus 3y is equal to 7 The next equation 5x plus y is equal to 9 Step number 1 From equation 2 Okay from equation 2 From any of the given two equations Find the value of one variable. Okay. Find the value of one variable in terms of other. So from equation 2. So equation 2 5x plus y is equal to 9. Then y is equal to find the one variable. Okay. So y is equal to minus 5 plus 5x right side goes to minus 5x plus 9. This is equation number 3. This is step number 1. We find the one variable. So, step number 2. Substitute the value of the variable obtained in step 1 in the other equation and solve it. We find that value of y. So, substitute equation 3 in 1. So, equation 3. Okay. 3 equation 3. Y is equal to minus 5x plus 9. So, substitute in equation number 1. So, equation number 1. 2x minus 3y is equal to 7. So, substitute the value of y in the equation. So, 2x minus 3 into value of minus 5x plus 9 is equal to 7. So, 2x minus 3 multiply with the inside minus 3 into minus 5 plus 5 3s are 15x minus 3 plus 9. So, 9 3s are 27 minus 27 is equal to 7. So, listen, so 15x plus 2x is equal to 17x is equal to 7 minus 27 right side goes to plus 27. So, 17x is equal to 34. x is equal to 34 divided by 17. Value of x is equal to 2. This is the value of x. Next, we find step number 3. Value of x substitute in any one equations. So, substitute x is equal to 2 in equation 3. So, equation 3, y is equal to minus 5x plus 9. So, y is equal to minus 5 into value of x 2 plus 9. 5 2s are 10. So, minus 10 plus 9. So, y is equal to minus 1. So, we find the two variables. One variable value x is equal to 2. Another variable value y is equal to minus 1. So, same method is second sum. 1.5 x plus 0.1 y is equal to 6.2. 3x minus 0.4 y is equal to 11.2. So, solution. Okay. The solution. So, first equation can be written as 1.5x plus 0.1 y is equal to 6.2. This is equation number 1. The next equation 3x minus 0.4 y is equal to 11.2. This is equation number 2. Okay. So, multiply. Equation number 1 multiply with the 10. Reason. We multiply with any decimal number. So, decimal number 1.5. So, 1 point. So, 1 point when we multiply with 10. In other case, uh, two decimals are in. So, we multiply with 100. So, 1.5. So, equation number 1 multiply with 10. So, decimal removed. So, 1.5x can be written as 15x. Reason 1.5 into 10 is equal to 15. Plus 0 0.1 into 10. 1. So, value of 1y is equal to 6.2 into 10, 62. This is equation number 3. So, the same method, second equation. So, second equation can be written as second equation multiply with 10 is equal to 3 into 10, 30x minus 0 0.4 into 10, 4y is equal to 11.2 into 10, 
one one two. This is equation number four. So step number one from any of the given two equations, find the value of one variable in terms of the other. So from equation one, fifteen x plus y is equal to sixty two. Okay. So one one can be written as three multiply with uh, one can be written as the same equation change to equation number three. So fifteen x plus y is equal to sixty two. Y is equal to for plus fifteen x right side goes to minus fifteen x plus sixty two. This is equation number five. Step number step number two substitute equation five in equation four. Okay, so the equation five y is equal to minus fifteen x plus sixty two. So equation number four thirty x minus four y is equal to one one two. So thirty x minus four into less than thirty x equation number four thirty x minus four y equal to one one two. So y substitute in y in the value. So thirty x minus four into value of y value of y minus fifteen x plus sixty two is equal to one one two. Thirty x minus four into minus fifteen plus sixty x minus four into sixty two. Two hundred and forty-eight is equal to one one two. So sixty x plus thirty x ninety x is equal to one one two minus two hundred and forty-eight. Right side goes to plus two hundred and forty-eight. So ninety x is equal to three hundred and sixty. X is equal to three hundred and sixty divided by nine zero zero cancel. So nine table four time possible. So x value of x is equal to four. We find the one variable. Next is step number three. Substitute the value of variable obtained in step number two in the result of step number one and get the value of remaining unknown variable. So substitute x is equal to four in equation five. So equation five y is equal to minus fifteen x plus sixty two. So y is equal to minus fifteen into value of x of four plus sixty two. So that is equal to minus fifteen into four minus sixty plus sixty two. Value of y is equal to two. So we find the two variable. One variable value x is equal to four. Then other variable value, other variable value y is equal to two. Okay. Thank you, student. Mm -hmm.